I'm on my way home from the grocery store. It's so fucking hot in here, jeez. I'm going back home to cook. What time is it? It's like 5.30. Damn, it's already 5.30. I took way longer than I should have. But yeah, I'm just gonna make a quick and easy recipe to cook, but I have work at um I had to work at um I have work at nine so I was like oh I don't have really nothing to do until nine well I mean I do have to get ready and shit but like I still have time to you know chill so I was like let me go on live because my plans for today were anyways I don't even know if I want to go into what happened today because it's too fresh for me to like really have like a unbiased opinion because I just feel like everybody is just always fucking pissing me off lately and I just don't want to be negative all the time on here so but yeah I was supposed to do stuff today but my plans canceled so well I mean I canceled my plans because people had me fucked up <laughs> So I was like, let me go on live. I just finished the groceries and shit. So let me go on live and chill with my bitches. Are you dumb? It's really hot though. I don't understand why it's this hot today. Like I have my whole fucking coat on it. Well, I don't have a winter coat on or anything, but I have a coat on because. Of it's been like cold as fuck for like the past I don't fucking know but yeah I need to roll up too the second I get home I'm gonna roll up I had to buy so much shit I had to buy litter for willy I had to buy so much groceries I had to go to the drugstore right next to the grocery store and buy some stuff they take it all my money like damn and it's crazy because i live alone right so i make groceries for myself and groceries for myself today was 130 130 for groceries for myself i can't even imagine families and shit how expensive it is to just feed your fucking self but i was really craving salmon so that's what I'm cooking today. I don't care. I was craving salmon so fucking bad. Like, I could eat salmon every day, no cap. Like, I just love that shit. Ugh. It just always does what it's supposed to fucking do. And it's so easy to cook. Like, I just love it. Oop, they're police. Fuck the police coming straight from the underground. A young nigga got him mad cause I'm brown. They have the authority to kill the minority. Fuck that shit cause I ain't the one for a punk motherfucker with a badge and a gun to be, what he said? Beating on. <laughs> I don't know what he says after that. <laughs> Y'all remember when Straight Outta Compton came out? 
y'all couldn't tell me nothing i hated the police well i mean i always hated the police but i hated the police for like years straight so bad Hurry up. Um, it's green. Oh, his car is cool. Oh, Berta, what you doing over here? I'm. I don't know if I'm the only one, but when I'm driving, I always look at people's plate and where they're from. And lately, there's been a lot of people from Ontario, a lot of people from Alberta. I'm like, what's going on here? Sorry. Sorry. Why is there so many police everywhere? What's going on? They say we in the hood with it. We in the hood with it. All right. This is why I hate. Because, yo, whenever I go to the grocery store, like, what the fuck is he doing? Whenever I go to the grocery store, I'm always like, oh, I'm going to go, like, at 4, at 5. But then on the way back, there's so much traffic because I always forget that, like, that's when people go off work. And I'm stuck in the traffic, mad as fuck. Like, what? Not businesswoman, period. Work better be chill as fuck today. Like, I really don't have time. This bitch better not be throwing up again. I will get so fucking mad. Like, these bitches are 30. You need to get... Like, because my work, you can be drunk at work. People won't give a shit. Cause like people just won't give a shit The boss is not there And the girl who's supposed to be the boss is always drunk So nobody's gonna give a fuck if you're drunk at work But at least like Get your shit together Like I don't know how to say it But just get your shit straight And I'm so mad because I could have slept so much more today and I'm so tired and I have to work until three, like. Ah. Oh. And I think I slept like three hours because I was supposed to have plans at two, right? And I woke up at one because I put my alarm at um, 12. But yo, I was looking at that shit like, yo, I can't do it. For like a whole hour, I was putting my shit on snooze, snooze. And yo. And yo, there's so much drama because when I got into work, into that job, like, I became close with the people who have my shifts. Obviously, there's a lot more people that work there. Well, not a lot, like we're, I don't know, like 25. But like, I'm only, close is a big word, but I'm only close to like, how can I say this? Like, okay, I was, I'm kind of close to like two people there because we're always on the same shifts. And when I got there, one of the bitch I'm close to is like, the one who trained me and shit right so it's like we're cool and she's they're both cool pe people they're not mean they're not rude they're not you know but it's just like yo there's so much to handle and it's like i'm 23 these bitches are in their 30s and i have to like deal with their shit and it's just so annoying
Not the fucking ambulance. Where the fuck do you want us to go, my nigga? This is crazy. Like, what? Yo, what? I don't know where the ambulance gonna go because I have to move for real. Can it pass? I don't want to be stuck in the middle of the street when the light turns red. That's like my biggest fear. I hate when that happens. The most ghetto shit. I hate this neighborhood. Like, get your shit together. Why is there so much traffic? Because I understand the, the highway is right there. So people are trying to get to the highway. But like, the highway is not even blocked. So why are people not moving? I think the lights are just too fucking long. Because there's no fucking way. Okay, just cut me off. Yeah, don't put your flasher either, babes. Just go ahead. This your, this your street. Go ahead. Yo, the Grim Reaper is here. Yo, there's a fucking homeless guy. Okay, and he's so fucking scary. He looks like death. Like, you know, in movies and shit, like, Death has the big cape. And, like, he, he's dressed exactly like that. And it's, like, this really tall, skinny white man with, like, this big cape. And he just walks around, like, yo. Like, I'm, like, yo. At first, I was, like, am I going to die? Because, like, I thought it was Death coming for me. Every day he's there, though. And then I was talking about it with one of my girls who used to live in this neighborhood. And she was, like, oh, that's the Grim Reaper. I was, like, the Grim Reaper. She was, like, yeah, everybody calls him that because he just looks like death. I was like, yo, he really do. All right, y'all, like I don't have the fucking time. I'm trying to cook my fish and play with my cat and smoke some weed and y'all is pissing me off. Go ahead, like. And I used to work right there too. Every time I pray, I'm like, ah! Because I worked right there and I'm just, I know they're not gonna see me from my car from over here, but like, I'm always just nervous that they're outside and they see me. Cause I just did a no call, no show and I just never went back. But those were like really, like that family really helped me out and shit. I kind of feel bad, so. Well, they didn't help me out. Let me not say that. They didn't give no extra money. They didn't. But they were just, you know, there. They were nice people. So I feel bad that I just never went back. But, like, she had me fucked up at the end. So I was just like, fuck it. I look so pretty without makeup, like. Honestly, sometimes I really need to just, you know, like it's given, I don't know, I don't know. Cause like for a while I was like, I'm so ugly without makeup, but I'm not, like I'm really not ugly wear. <laughs> but honestly, when I don't have makeup on, I need to have my hair done though. If it, my hair is not done and I don't have makeup on, don't talk to me. Like, I'm not even... <laughs> I'm not even going to answer if you see me without makeup and hair. I'm going to just... Yeah, no. I'm going to just act like I don't know nobody. But, yeah, my skin is a little dry right now because I actually did not moisturize at all. But you can't see it on camera, so it's fine. All right, we almost there. I love it when you do it. I'm right there, right there. Oh my God, I don't even know how I'm gonna bring all this shit inside. Oh my God, it's gonna be a situation for sure. God damn, nigga. 
Jesus. The sun is out, poom poom out, and everything. See, I've been driving for 15 minutes because I've been on life for 15 minutes. The fucking grocery store is five minutes away, so the traffic is just not it right now. All right, nigga, like. I think I'm just hungry to be honest because who even walks here where is he coming from the highway is right there so where is he walking from this is what's killing me every time I see somebody walk there I'm like where are you coming from the highway like you walk the highway yo next time they put their fucking bicycle right there I'm Yo, running over that shit. Now what? There's literally a line. My landlord had to put... Because these fucking neighbors are stupid as fuck. So... And they used the whole fucking driveway to get into the parking. For their trash or whatever the fuck. So my landlord went and put a line. Like, okay, this is where car... This is where you have your space to put your stuff. And this is where the cars are going to come in. And they still don't know where to put their stuff. Next time I'm running over your baby's bike, I don't care. You could be mad, you still won't have no bike, bitch. Let me just put this right here. At least my hair is done for the night, so all I have to do is just freshen up and do my makeup for work. So okay, so how are we gonna do this for real? I think I'm gonna just bring this back first and then I'm gonna come back because I'm not strong. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to just bring my phone inside so it can be on the Wi-Fi. Hey, Willie. You were eating good? Hey, Willie. Say hi to people. He said you. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to just leave, leave my phone right here, bring everything in, and I'll be right back. Oh, actually, let me take it.
this was heavy. Okay. Willy Wonkers. Willy Wonkers. Say hello. Say hi, guys. Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka. The amazing chocolates here. Hooray, Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka. Say hi. You so boring. You so boring. Aya Willy. That's how you is. All right, let me take this off. Put some, put some, put some, put some. No, I'm playing. Um, okay. So I'm just gonna put this stuff inside the fridge i need to throw some stuff out too and i'm kind of over this hair right now so i'm gonna tie it ah stop playing what the fuck shut up Whatever. Willie, get out of the way. Truly, honestly. Yo, the cat litter was so heavy. Ah. I don't want to deal with that. I just need to throw some stuff in my fridge. Let me just take a baggy baggy. Oh, please tell me this is a big one. Okay, it is a big one. I thought I bought a small one. I was like, ah. Bitch. All right, I'm back. I'm just gonna put the stuff in the fridge. And then I'm gonna roll up. And then I'm gonna smoke. And then I'm gonna cook. That's the plan or not? Um, what is that? Okay, nothing in here needs to go in the fridge. What's in here? going in the food now this not for you you got your food over there oh i have another bag i 
got the bag of family. I got the bag of family. family. The mama a thought. And she got eggs. And she gonna fuck up a bed. Pull up to the spot. Living too fast. Okay, this is... The rest is just not fridge, so... Okay, so I'm gonna just put this over here. And I already did the dishes yesterday, so I have to do dishes today. This is clean. I hate doing dishes. Dishes can suck my ass. Yo, this is literally, I don't care what y'all say. I know people don't like minute rice. I love minute rice and I love their cheesy minute rice. It's this rice, what's it called? The creamy cheddar cheese. I, it's so fucking good. Like they they knew what they were doing when they made that. Like I know it doesn't even sound good, but one time they, they had no like white rice. So I had to figure out like a substitute because I don't like cooking rice. I just don't like, it's like if I can put it in the microwave, why the fuck am I going to do, like unless I'm making like, and see like um, some Haitian rice and stuff like that, like obviously, but if I'm just doing rice as a side, why do I need to cook my own fucking rice? Like nobody has time for that. I'm just leave it here. All right. It's rolling time, Willie. It's rolling time. He like, girl, go roll and leave me alone. If this cat had a voice, he would be cussing me out. What the fuck is rice a -roni? I mean, I don't think we have that here. Here we only have Uncle Ben's minute rice. I think we have other minute rice, but nobody uses that. Okay, so now you're going to do the most elastic. Right, like how am I how am I an adult? Like I don't even know what's going on. Like get a rice cooker. You gonna buy me a rice cooker? Like what? Yo, I don't have rice cooker. I mean, I could probably buy a rice cooker, but I'm not gonna spend my money on a rice cooker. Already if I'm gonna buy something for cooking right now it would be an air fryer. I feel like that would help me a lot. But even then I like cooking my shit on a pan. Like I don't like putting stuff in the oven. Unless it's obviously like I need to put stuff in the oven, but if not, I don't see the point. I need to brush this hair out. I mean, I want an air fryer, but it's like, bro, I have, because I have this, um, what's that called? Oh my God, I know the name. I know the name. What's it called? Anyways, I have a little small oven like that, but because in my last apartment, my oven was just like, I was not using, yeah, toaster oven. That's what I was looking for, but Basically, because in my last apartment, my oven, I was just not using that shit. It was like an oven from like, child, it was an oven from like 1912, bitch. Like, I was not using that. So, like, you couldn't even type, like, it wasn't in an oven that you could be like, okay, let me boop, 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 put the, the, the heat, whatever. It's like, you had to turn, yo, I was just like, yo. I'm not using that, so my mom bought me that for, I think, Christmas or my birthday or whatever. Just a holiday, she bought me that. But now here, I use, like, my actual oven, but I never use it like that, to be honest. Like, I'm just, like, because me, I don't do, I don't know what's my problem. And a lot of people are, like, you're fucking stupid, but it's, like, I don't know what it is, but I can't eat leftovers like that. I can, but I can't. Like, for example, if I'll make something in the oven, like let's say I'll make a lasagna in the oven or whatever, 
I'll eat like half of it and I'll, I'll throw the rest away. So I just don't. Because I feel like stuff like that is when you're like a big family and it'll go away fast or whatever. But me, it's just like, I don't like eating the same shit every day. So. What's so great about an air fryer? It's just basically like, it's going to cook your food so much faster than if you put it in the oven. And it's like going to make it really moist. And it's going to, like, you, it's just so easy. It's like. You just season shit and just put it in there instead of just like cooking in the oven for like 45 minutes. You just cook it in there for like 15, you know. Not my phone dying. I mean, I, I still have 20%. We're going to be fine. Willie. He just, he just always stands there. Where is he? And just stares at me. Yes. You're so cute. You know you're cute, eh? Yeah, he said. Period. Yo, and I need to buy uh, new papers. Oh, this is my last filter, too. This is why I don't understand. Why don't they have the same amount of filters as they do papers? It doesn't make sense. Uh. Uh. Air fryers are good for leftovers, yeah. I need to, like, force myself to make food and just, like, meal prep and then eat it. But the thing is, I'm not going to want to eat it. And one thing about me, I don't play about food. Like, if I don't want to eat it, I'll just eat something else. I don't care how broke I am. I mean, obviously, if I'm broke as fuck and I'm starving, it is what it is. But, like, I'm not at that point right now where it's like, uh, I don't know how I'm going to eat tonight. So, it's like, <laughs> bitch, I'll eat what I want, you know? Life is too short to eat what you don't want to eat. kills me he's so dramatic like why is he staring into the wall like he's in depression or something like girl i'd be too lazy to cook so i eat the same thing for a week i feel you though but most things i cook are not like hard shit to cook like like i was saying right now i'm about to cook salmon because i know this is like the quickest shit i know how to cook and it's always gonna fucking hit and i also been craving salmon because i could honestly i could eat salmon every day like dead ass doesn't matter how it's cooked i've never really had like raw salmon like that other than in sushi and stuff but like i'm pretty sure i'd like it like i really just love it It's so fucking good, and one thing about it, it's going to hit every time. Every time. Willie, I'm going outside to smoke. You going to be good? You're not going to destroy the house? Why is he acting like that? Like, please, what, what type of position is that? And, like, what's going on with him? Like, what you depressed about, bitch? You home all day. You you living a life. You sleep all day. You eat good. I play with you. He's just mad because I left him, I think. He's not even trying to fall asleep because I know where he goes when he wants to fall asleep. Come at least lay in the bed. I don't like you laying on the ground like that. You have a whole bed for you. And yo, what kills me the most is that when I when I got him, he was like, the guy at the the shelter was like, yo, 
you should buy him, you know, a little bed so he could get covered. This nigga don't want no bed. He want my bed. He want to take the whole space in my bed. Thank God I didn't buy him a bed because I would have been mad that he was in mine just acting like it's his. I'll be right back, Willy Wonks. Um... Yeah, let me just use that as a... I wish my backyard, like, had something under it so I could let Willie out in my backyard and, you know, he could just walk around and stuff. But it's like, if I let him outside, he could always go under right here. Hold on. He could just always go under right here that's how so many cats came into my backyard before so <coughs> you know oh my god i dropped the spliff that means deshaun is cheated on <laughs> y'all heard that if you drop the spliff or the blood that means they're cheating on you i mean we're not even together but He's still cheating. Whew, I got scared. I thought it was a spider up there. <sighs> what time is it? It's six, okay. We still have time. I have to start getting ready at seven, so. Because I have to leave at eight. And the craziest part about it is that my work is technically like not even 20 minutes from here. <coughs> but because it's downtown and there's literally no parking anywhere, it takes me forever to find a parking. Sometimes, though, I find one like this. And honestly, I've been pretty lucky, but oh, it's like last time I got so mad because last time um, I was like, okay, I left like kind of a little bit late but technically not late like i left for example if i started at nine today it's like i left at 8 30 so technically like it's less than a 20 minute drive so i wasn't late but like okay so because there's a lot of construction around my work i was driving and then i saw a place like for example i'm like right here and i see a spot for parking right here but to get to that parking right here, I have to go around like this to get that parking right here. I can't just go like this, right? So I'm like, oh, okay, I'm going to get it. And then I turn and there's a car right in front of me. And it took the spot. Yo, I was, I literally stood right next to the car for like five minutes. I was like, there's no fucking way. There's no way you just took my spot. Like, there's no way. I need it more than you. And then I found parking mad far. But then actually, I got lucky because then there was a fucking explosion. And there was fire everywhere. So my car could have been fucked up if I... I don't think the cars where I was supposed to get to park were fucked up. But I would have been even more nervous. So How's overnight? Um, Honestly, it's fine. I'm not, <coughs> it's fine because I don't work a lot, you know, like if I worked five days a week <coughs> overnight, <coughs> I don't think it'd be fine, you know, but since I make my own schedule, I work like three times a week, it's cool, and it's like today it's not even overnight like that because it's nine to three, but usually like tomorrow i'm gonna do 11 to 5 a.m that's when it fucks me up because i mean i make my own schedule and my own hours and shit but like yo i always regret 11 to 5 but then i'm like 
I'm gonna be up till 5 a.m. at home anyway, so I'd rather just go to work late. Cause I'm gonna be up anyways at home, so it's not gonna like it's gonna fuck up my schedule. Cause my schedule is already fucked up. And honestly, I'm more of a night person. Like I, I'm always up. Like if it was just for me, even before I did overnight shifts and stuff like that, I'm always up at night. So it's like, it works for me. And at least it's like a six hour shift and it's not like hard on my body or anything so it's like it's just chilling you know it's not i don't do much you know but But I just always found comfort in like nighttime. I don't know why it's so comforting to me. Like, it's just the world is quiet. It's just you and your thoughts and shit. <laughs> That's what you get in your feelings. That's what you get fucked up in your head. <laughs> it's comforting to me. <coughs> Yo, I can't believe I'm still sick. It's literally been two weeks. I mean, I'm not really sick like that, but like I still have a stuffy nose a little bit. It's not that bad. Like it's not the type of stuffy nose that you can't sleep. Like you know those ones. Like you know the first few days where you literally can't sleep because you can't breathe. It's not those ones, but it's like it's still like. It's still stuffy and then now like it's just fucked up i'm still uh, when i smoke just even a little bit i like yo last time i was home alone and i was drinking and smoking whatever and i didn't even drink that much like i took like maybe two cups of liquor whatever like i was home anyways just living my life you know and then i smoke a, a second split and i started like i started cuffing so fucking bad that i just started throwing up and i was like oh my god like <laughs> oh my god what is happening child Ooh, i'm so excited to eat i'm gonna do <clears throat> broccoli salmon and cheesy rice that's gonna be so fucking good <coughs> oh my god <coughs> i had that happen before too is the worst it's so disgusting like <coughs> because it's like you're cuffing 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 and then you throw up and your throat is dry while throat is disgusting it's literally the worst I, I can't. I'm making shrimp scampi. You know I've never had shrimp scampi. I know, I know, I know. I've never had that. I don't know why. Child, I thought she was speaking to me. I was like, who? miss you too girl what is so good i know i heard it's really good i just never had it like i heard it in a was it like in a movie or like i don't know where i heard it before and i was like what the fuck is a shrimp scampi like what the fuck is that like i just i never heard that before and then i saw what it was and i was like this looks good as fuck like why did nobody tell me about that but at the same time, I have a love-hate relationship with shrimp. So.
Because <laughs> honestly, I like shrimp, but sometimes I hate shrimp. Like, I don't know. I have, like, sometimes I'm like, oh. And it's like, I could love any type of shrimp. I can like cold or hot shrimp. It don't matter, big or small, whatever. But then sometimes it's like, ew, like. I don't want no shrimp. Like, I don't know what it is. And it's like, it's not even top three for me. Like, seafood wise. Like, seafood wise, if I'm doing top three, it would be salmon first, duh. Then it would be fried calamari. Like, oh my god. Like, fried calamari is so good. And then the third one, what would the third one be actually? I mean, I just love fish, so it would just be whatever type of fish, but I haven't had crab in so... Oh, I, w I would put lobster uh, three, because I haven't had crab in way too... I haven't had crab since I was a kid, so I just remember it's such a, like, specific childhood memory, too, and I don't have that many of those, but, like... At one point when my parents got divorced, it was a couple years later though, but my dad went to live in this apartment and he stayed there for like two months max. But like he was there and I went there and we were just eating crab legs on the floor. Like that's just really like such a specific childhood memory. And I don't, rem I remember liking it, but I don't even remember like eating that afterwards like i don't remember eating crab afterwards so ever had lamby conch what is that mm. i mean i had crab after like crab cakes but i haven't had crab legs in a fucking long time Like, yeah, my first time eating it was crab legs, and then I ate it in crab case. That's it. I never had crab again in my life. Nothing top salmon for me. Me neither. It's so good. <coughs> Yo. <coughs> it's just so good. And it's so easy to make. And it's just so good. Like, it's to me salmon is better than chicken i'm not even gonna cap like chicken is so overrated to me i haven't cooked chicken in forever chicken is just like it's good but it's not like the baddest bitch in the stove do i like sushi i mean i don't hate it like i can i can eat sushi and enjoy it but, like, if you told me right now I would never be able to eat sushi again, I wouldn't cry about it. But it's good, but it's not, like, I don't know how to explain it. Because I know some people, like, love sushi. Like, they're obsessed with sushi. But me, it's, like, I like it, but I'm just kind of indifferent. Like, it's good. Like, if you're, like, oh, let's go eat sushi, like, I'll eat it. But, like. Like, I feel like there's so much Asian food that's better than sushi, like. Like, yo, if you're asking me Asian food, we can go fucking eat Thai food. Like, are you dumb or Korean food before sushi? Like, what? Girl, now you about to traumatize the sushi eaters, no cap. I never had crab fried rice. That sounds good. Korean food is just child, they just knew what the fuck they were doing. Like even their fried chicken is really good. Their pork is good. Their sauces are good. 
the spices are good everything's on point okay i need to go cook because i don't want to get too hot because then i'm gonna eat and fall asleep and i have to go to work so okay i'm low-key a little high so i'm high enough Okay. For show, sure, for show. Sure. I don't know why I cook when I'm high when I know that I'm not gonna enjoy myself. Willie's. Don't look at this. Willie. What's poppin'? What's poppin', Willers? What's poppin'? You wanna cook for me? Hello? <laughs> you don't wanna cook for me? He fake. I thought you were my man. Like, he comes to cut up with me all night. He always talking shit in the morning, always trying to kiss up on me. But now when I want dinner, it's quiet. Bet, bet. <laughs> now he following me. Okay. Um. What was I cooking? Oh yeah. Okay, I'm gonna wash my hands. Oh my god, my phone is dying too. My phone is at 10%. Okay. Willie, get out the way, child. What if I need? Oh. Okay. We have a problem. How am I going to How am I going to charge my phone? Okay, yeah, I could just put my phone right there. We're, we're gonna try this. This is too ghetto. Get out the way, Willie. Live my life 
if this cost 10 just the fish like not even the whole meal that's crazy but it's working because i'm hungry so butter garlic is it the right one i took the wrong one Broccoli, soy sauce, and for the spices, pink salt, cause pink wig thick ass give a whip lash, period, pepper, cool run-ins, period, Honey, period. And whatever the fuck is in my pantry. Like, I got garlic powder. I got some spices. I don't even know what's in this, but I got paprika, roasted garlic and peppers. And the garlic is right here. It's the garlic puree. It's like it's not minced, but it's like puree. Period. So, oh, we got the rice too, but like, I just put it in my microwave. So I'll just do that at the end. But um. So we gonna cut a lemon up because we're gonna wash the fish, period. Cause we clean like you just can't even spell clean. Like, where am I? Okay, so I couldn't find my Favorite towel, so I just picked up a new one. So, period. Like, I'm nervous. Uh. Oh my god, I was like, what's that noise? It's literally Willy. Like, what the fuck? Oh my god, this, the fucking lemon smells mad strong. Mm, 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 mm. Um. Why is this taking forever? Like, I need to go. It's already 6 30. Like, Willie, really shut up. You're stressing me out. <coughs> <Come on. coughs> okay. So, I just use lemon and I just like put it on the salmon and just wash it with water too. I'm not going to like put vinegar or whatever the fuck other people put because I'm lazy. I feel like lemon does the job, period. And wash your skin too. Because just wash it. I don't know, that's what I was told. Now I'ma just let it sit. Oh 
I'm gonna just let it sit for like five minutes without touching it. And I'm gonna just wash my hands because I just touched salmon pum pum. Like, I'm not gonna have that on my hands. I'm going to cut half this broccoli. I'm going to rinse and then put it in the thing with butter and garlic and spices. So. I'm literally like doing a cooking show right now. Period. This need to move out of the way. Like. Okay. Mm, no, actually, what we're gonna do is that. So, so I just got water on my face. We're gonna use half this broccoli, and we're gonna rinse it. Because we don't trust these hoes. We do not trust these hoes. Period. Rinse it thoroughly, bitch. Like your life depends on it. Like you're getting paid. Once it's rinsed, the fuck out. I don't know why I use a paper towel for everything. Because I have like... You know those like things like that. I don't know, it's too far. Like those things that you can just put food on and then just cut on it. But I just rather use paper towels. I don't know what it is. Like I just rather use paper towels. Like it's cleaner to me. Um I will use the same one as the lemon because nobody can fuck. And I'ma just cut up the pieces of broccoli. Damn, I should have put some music, but too late. I don't want to unfocus on this, and then it'd be hard for me to focus again, because I do got to get to work at one point. If I didn't have to get to work, I'll just take my sweet time with this, but I just got to go make some money, honey. Period. Take a shot every time I say period. Because clearly same period is what I was meant to do. And I just cut them also in smaller um, pieces with my hands because I like smaller broccoli. I don't like big ass broccoli. Like get out of my face. Unless it's that good broccoli, then I like good nugs, you know, but real broccoli, you know, we like them a little bit small, you know, not too big. Just the right size. Okay, that's good. I like a lot of broccoli, so I really took the whole half. But I'm going to use the other half for the next meal. Okay, now I need to put butter in the pan. Um, why is this mad loud? Anyways, wait, is my phone charged yet? Okay. It's at 32, so y'all can come back over here. Okay. Period. Like, why does it look cute low-key? 
It could be like a plant. I don't know. Okay, so. Yeah, let me season the fish. Don't mind my belly, like, a bitch be eating. So, we're going to start with a little bit of garlic powder. A little salt and pepper. Hold on. Okay, I think I can put the broccoli in there because the butter is melting fast. I'ma just put y'all can see my bra this whole time. Y'all not been saying nothing. Anyways, I'll put some garlic in there. I'ma also put some garlic powder in there. And a little bit of water. And I'm gonna put the thing on it. So look, this is what it's supposed to look like. They just put it on top. I'll mix it later because Okay, so I put garlic powder, pepper, salt. I don't know if I put them already, but whatever. Paprika. Not your apartment flooding. She's a hater. She don't want to see you win. Because how you flooded on my sis like that? Like, just keep up with the water. Like, that's your job. Um, I'm just putting anything and everything at this point. I don't even care. I just dropped some on my foot. Okay, so at the end, the fish should be red. That's how I know that I season it up. Okay. I'll be right back, y'all. Hold on. Okay, so I just put like one line of oil like that and then I put it at like medium heat period and I'm gonna just mix the broccoli I'm gonna just add what's the um, pepper and salt, but I'm gonna do it like not while holding it because that's too hard. Okay, I opened this already. Is it hot? It's not really hot. <laughs> Willie's just waiting there next to the fridge. He's so funny, bro. Um, yeah, so for now, there's nothing to do. Mm. 
no rent for five months. Willie, we're flooding this bitch. We're flooding this bitch. Oh my god, why is cooking so hard while being alive? Like, make it make sense. I gotta be at work for nine. Yeah, nine, so. I put the spices in the, in the pan too, you know? And I always put the fish like like body first not skip I don't know I didn't want to say body they sounded weird but like not body but I hate waiting for the food to, for the food to cook. Like, just hurry up. I put my vape at. Willie, you stole my vape. Oh, maybe I left it in the car still. I think I left it in the car. Uh, I look at my bag just to be sure. Oh, I just found $10. Well, it's in my bag, so it's my ten dollars. But yeah, no, I left it in the car. It's okay. It's What 
be. So. I used to be a coordinator, but I quit. Cause people had me fucked up. I can't wait to eat my food and watch fucking Desperate Housewives. Like, I'm just so excited. So that's why this feed, this feed. I'm not dealing with my dad right now. So, the fish needs to start looking like that. Like, kind of like it's burnt. I like when my food is a little burnt. If you don't like it like that, just cook it less. But then I'm going to do the sauce right now. Um, I'm going to just add a little butter. But I'm actually moving the pan out. It's like too hot right now. I'm going to just add butter. Garlic puree. I'm going to add the soy sauce. And the honey. And then like I kind of just mix it around. I'll show y'all the end result because this is so hard to do while cooking, while fucking filming. I don't know how people do that. I'm going to go cook my rice in the microwave, period. Because, see, if I had to do rice, too, like, it's just too much. Like, Hey, baby. Okay. 
Okay, so actually, okay, I'm gonna open the fire. And then I let it cook like two, three minutes in the sauce, like nothing crazy. See, this is like the easiest dinner ever. And you feel like you a chef for real, like you feel like you got it together. So it should look like that. You feel the vibes, you feel the vibes, period. So now I'm gonna just make sure the middle is cooked. Okay, it's not cooked enough to my liking, so I'm gonna just. And it so fucking good. <laughs> Hello? Hello? <coughs> you good? <laughs> you good, my nigga? This cat is not okay. Okay, so I'm gonna take a plate. So basically how I do this, y'all can't even see your Okay. I put the rice on this. I never eat all of the rice, but I'm just too lazy to not all put it in the on the plate like that right Just to make it 
I'm going to put some parsley just to make it cute. What up, bitch? Period. Y'all see that? All me. All me. And then I'm going to drink that with my nesty. Y'all already know what's up. Yeah, I'm going to just put this lower. Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka. Ooh, that's not what I meant to do. So I'm gonna take a couple bites with y'all, but then I'm gonna go watch my show because that's my show. So um yeah, let me just put some lemon on the fish because it always makes it better. I'm gonna take a bite of everything. No, the plan on my table is not real. It was a gift, but it's not real. I wouldn't be able to keep it, keep it, you know, going. Oh. Mm mm. Mm mm. It's hot. Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. I almost died. I almost died. Oh my God, the fish is so hot. Yo, I'm gonna let it sit for a second because yo, that shit was hot, but it was good. Oh. Oh my god. But see, it's all juicy. The rice is mad good. Broccoli, mad good. You can see the spice. Mad good. For now, I'm going to just eat the rice and the broccoli because that shit is so hot. Oh, hell no. Period. Period for real. Yo, I'm trying to take like just a small bite because it's so fucking good. Oh my god, it's so good. What the fuck? It's like I did something even better today. Like, it's mad good. See, this is why Summit is never gonna disappoint. Summit is always gonna be there for me. Oh my god. Oh, it was hot. Yo, it low-key burned my mouth a little bit. No fucking cap. But anyways, guys, I kind of need to get my shit together right now and, like, eat faster and start getting ready for work. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed my little... It was a now and 30-minute live, so y'all can't complain. Um... But thank you guys for watching. I love y'all and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.